Are you a Chief Information Security Officer, Head of Cybersecurity, Security Analyst, or do you want to automate countermeasures to security incidents? Let's take a look at how Workato can help you achieve your security objectives. According to Gartner, 88% of board directors classified cybersecurity attacks as a business risk rather than a technology risk. That's why organizations establish security operations teams to fight cybersecurity attacks. The state of SOAR report shows SecOps teams handle 11,000 alerts per day on average, and 70% of their time is used for investigation, triage, and response. This underscores the need for automation to remove as many repetitive manual tasks as possible in order to allow security analysts to focus on the most critical incidents. The landscape of cybersecurity infrastructure is massive and constantly changing. To get the most value out of these systems, automation workflows need to be orchestrated across the board. This also provides visibility into the overall security posture of the organization. It's a function of the organization's strength to detect and respond to incidents. To get to the upper right corner, it needs both visibility into every incident happening, as well as fast and high-quality response. That's where SOAR comes in. SOAR brings all incidents into a single pane of glass and orchestrates and automates the entire incident response workflow. SOAR is an acronym that stands for Security, Orchestration, Automation, and Response. Let's have a look at the anatomy of a SOAR process. At a high level, a SOAR process consists of four stages. It starts with an incident being identified by an external system. That incident then gets ingested into the SOAR pipeline. Next is enriching incidents. Incidents typically contain information about what happened, when, and where, but you often need to gather additional information from other systems to get the full picture. The triaging stage often involves manual human tasks, and it's where security analysts bring in their domain knowledge. Eventually, they need to decide what to do on a per-incident basis. And if the decision is to take action by responding to an incident, then a so-called incident response playbook kicks in. These playbooks typically include remediation actions to contain incidents or prevent them from happening in the first place. However, the challenge is to find the right balance between leveraging the security analyst's domain knowledge for manual tasks and automating processes to save time and address more incidents. Here is an example SOAR process for hunting malicious domains. It starts with Splunk, which is a security analytics platform, by identifying users browsing to domains never before seen in the organization. After receiving the alert from Splunk, VirusTotal is used to check the reputation of the target domain. In case it actually looks like a malicious website, the security analysts get notified to have a look at this incident. In this example, the notification is simply a Slack message. And finally, if the security analyst decides to quarantine the user's machine to contain a possible malware, Sentinel-1 is called to disconnect the machine from the local network. Before we take a look at how to implement this use case, a quick introduction to Workato. Workato is an award-winning platform for integration and workflow automation across your organization. It offers a low-code, no-code platform that can integrate your cloud apps, databases, legacy systems, file servers, and network devices, and automate your workflows end-to-end -end across your apps, data, and teams. It enables builders across lines of business, such as sales, HR, IT, marketing, finance, and security to design automations. The core building block of these automations is a Workato recipe, which describes a set of tasks that get work done across apps. They can be installed with the click of a button or easily customized. Each recipe is comprised of a trigger and one or more actions that are executed when a trigger event is picked up. The entire workflow, starting from ingesting incidents up to performing response actions, can be implemented within Workato. Workato also provides the application connectors for Splunk, VirusTotal, Slack, and Sentinel-1, with triggers and actions for each of the workflow steps. Let's have a look at these recipes. This is the first recipe that gets triggered by Splunk, which asks VirusTotal for domain reputation and then posts a message in Slack. It provides a very intuitive interface describing the business logic. To reduce the number of false positive alerts, it checks if the domain has been classified as malicious. 
The second recipe gets triggered by Slack when the security analyst decides to quarantine the machine. It then calls Sentinel-1 and posts a confirmation message back on Slack. Now let's start both recipes and open a malicious website. Splunk immediately raises an alert because nobody within the organization has visited this website ever before. Just a second later, we receive the Slack message and then put the machine in quarantine. This example demonstrates a simple and straightforward way of implementing SOAR workflows. So why is Workado the best place for security automations? Instead of multiple uncoordinated integration platforms, Workado makes integrating and automating your security apps and infrastructure possible from one place. This doesn't require any developer as there is no need for coding. The security operations team can build custom security workflows themselves by leveraging existing connectors from the library. Here is what Nutanix, a major cloud computing company, is saying about their use of Workado for security. They automate the assignment and triage of security tickets, which allows them to handle incidents in less time, which increases the overall security posture. Just to give you an idea about apps and systems that can be leveraged for ingesting new incidents, these range from pure on-prem systems to modern cloud native security solutions. There are obviously many more, but thanks to Workado's integration capabilities, you can connect to any app in almost no time. The same goes for Enriching Incidents, which aims to make triaging and responding to incidents easier. Typically in this phase, information about assets and identities involved in the incident is gathered. Triaging often requires some user interface for security analysts. That could be as simple as a messaging platform like Teams or Slack, or a more comprehensive incident management platform. This is where security domain experts decide how to respond to individual incidents. That's either by performing single response actions or entire response playbooks. But again, it's not limited to the apps you see here. With Workado, you can connect to any security system or application. The larger and more complex an organization becomes, and the more security incidents occur, the more challenges an organization faces. The first is that security operation teams are often not well prepared for unknown or unexpected incidents. At the time they integrate analytics platforms with Workado, they don't necessarily know all the possible incidents that might come up in the future. That means they cannot lay out the steps required for handling these incidents at integration time. So what's needed is some kind of smart incident pipeline that automatically decides which enrichment steps to perform at the time an incident happens, and not at the time the system is integrated. The next challenge is when a flood of incidents occurs, but it turns out many are actually duplicates or symptom of the same root cause. That's why there is a need to automatically deduplicate incidents to prevent unnecessary efforts when performing triage and response actions. That way you can spend more time on what's important and therefore reduce the average incident response time. Next is lack of visibility. Many analytics platforms provide their own version of an overview dashboard. Ironically, this leads security operation teams to maintain multiple panes of glass and prevents visibility and reporting across the entire organization. What's needed is an aggregated investigation workbench for reviewing, classifying, assigning, and escalating incidents, as well as running security reports across the org. Lastly, response actions are often built right into end-to-end -end workflows, meaning they are tied to specific incidents and use cases. However, what security analysts really need is a catalog of fully reusable response actions or even entire response playbooks to pick from. That way, it's also possible to have AI technologies to automatically propose the response actions. As security operation teams scale and mature, the more they need enterprise-grade SOAR capabilities to address these challenges. With Workado, you can bring incidents from various systems into a single pane of glass and orchestrate the entire incident pipeline up to performing remediation actions. This provides better visibility into incidents, allowing you to perform the right response faster. Ultimately, Workado helps implement your SOAR workflows and thus increases the security posture of your organization. If you'd like to learn more about Workado for SOAR, please reach out.